Dum dum dum. Dum 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 dum. dum. <laughs> Come on, boys! Tie your way out! Come on, hand you with a cocktail! What up, Snatch Use, my friend? Dominus and Phineas! Big motherfucking kick your ass, Boozy! Dan Susie! Air Belt! Hail to the king! And as always, Sick Domatic! What up, Smitty! Mr. Saluka got the big guns. What up? Paula Cavelli. Hope everybody doing well. Bengals 88 and Big Joe 420. Woo! I'm fired up. Whew, it's been a long night already. I got one card. Harmon Killebrew Autograph. I don't even know. I paid like seven bucks ship for that baby. One of the finest autographs known to man. This is going to be my little response video to uh, A.R. Felt, five questions. Who is somebody who I'd like to have lunch with that's gone? That's an easy one. That'd be my father, who passed away in an accident damn near 20 years ago. Long time ago already. And uh, my sister. She's been gone almost, whoa, shit, she's been gone a lot longer than that. Anyway, Wendy, I hope you're doing okay wherever you're at. Hope Dad's taking care of you. I'm sure he is. Uh, Dad was uh, the leader in the clubhouse. He was the head honcho of the whole show. A superior hunter. I can still think we were just talking about the other day with my mom. He'd sit out in the duck blind. He'd have just some them packs of like 10 gloves and yellow ones that carpenters wore. He's a carpenter. He'd have, if he had them on, that'd be it. Shit, we had battery gloves, whatever, and he just had a big beard, we had ice cube sickles on it, and he'd be sitting there just scanning. He always was scanning for ducks. Fucking ducks would come in. Oh, shoot. His marks with the bull. Bull hunting was his favorite. We hunted all the time. Played ball. Our backyard was a dirt field in the backyard. We didn't hardly have to mow our backyard because it was always playing ball. We were always playing ball. Matter of fact, when all those boys got old enough and left, some of the young neighbor kids would come over to my mom's and ask if Roger, his name was Roger, they called him Rocky, if Rocky could come out and play. Isn't that something? Because their own dads were too busy. But that's who I'd want to go out to eat with, see how Pops is doing, because he always made everything better. If you're doing well, Dad. And it was funny because I remember watching Smitty's video and a Ravens fan video, and he had his dad on there, and I remember watching Smitty saying, you know, he thought of his dad and said, I thought exactly the same thing. Because my dad bought us a lot of cards. Most of you guys probably don't remember, but R.C. Cola used to have baseball players on their cans. Many, many years ago, I had the whole collection. And now I don't know what I did with them. They're gone. But we used to buy them all the time. If you look them up on eBay, I bet they're on there. They used to have a football or baseball player on there. Hey, I'm a little half of the bagger, but not too bad. Anyway, sorry, God, this video's getting long, but hey, sick Domatic says, if you don't like it, get the fuck out of here. This is my channel. Who would I want to go out to you with that's alive? You know, I thought about this and listened to some other people's. I'm really not too impressed with Hollywood or athletes. Not that I wouldn't want to hang out with AP or Molly Crew or Old Van Halen or ACDC or some of them guys. I'd rather hang out with you guys. I'd rather... Hang out with Smitty, Sickdomatic, Stay Style, Style, or Wenzel 888 Bengals 88, Big Joe, me and Bert Caddy, and then I can hang out with him for a little while. For a little while. I'd rather hang out with a bunch of tubers on here, have a cocktail, hey, have a burger fry, I don't care. Just shoot the shit and say, how you really doing? So you know what? Fuck Hollywood. The chicks of the big racks. Well, maybe Hollywood. <laughs> Woo! What's going on, boys? I don't hang out with you guys. Uh, let's see, uh, YouTuber to come back. It's easy. I just saw him tonight. Well, I didn't see him, but he's on Danny's room. Techno Bailey. I think we can get him back. Well, I can't because I don't think he even watches my videos, but which I don't blame him. Techno Bailey, Big Country. You know, Big Country, now his name is 33 Big Country. I have not seen a video. But he commented on one of mine, 
I think he's going to slide back. Danielle, DRB, whatever, 036, whatever number. I'd like to see her back. Techno Bailey, Big Country, and Danielle. That's who I want back. Oh, this is getting a lot of work here. I can't even see the time on this video. Ah, who was my biggest influence growing up? My dad, of course. Oh, I, both my parents. My mom's. My mom's a dream. You know, the Batker boys, we grew up with... We were grew up, we couldn't handle any better. Played ball, hunt, fish, sports, do whatever we wanted. We didn't. We weren't rich by no means. Oh, God, no. And we always were new the right path. We didn't always take it. Of course, me and my older brother especially didn't. You know, you get the handcuffs thrown on you and, you know, you know, hey, we won't go into details. But, you know, I haven't always been this cool. Oh, it's been all over. I'm, you know, I'm all, I'm in love. Huh, I'm all shook up. Boom, snap. I'm in the back. I'm in the band. We haven't always been this cool. But we're doing all right. We're doing all right. Anyway, it'd be uh, my dad, my mom, and my grandma on my dad's side. Not nothing wrong with my grandma and my mom's side. Old Grandma Becker, what a dream gal. The most kindest, hardest, hearted lady ever. God, I'm getting all shook up here. That, that, that's enough of that. Uh, who currently inspires me? I'm not really impressed by a whole lot of people because everybody thinks they're all that in a bag of fucking chips. They think money fucking controls everything. I never had any money, so I can give a fuck how much money anybody's got. I don't give a fuck what kind of job you got. If you be cool and be decent, then you're in with Tommy B. Ooh, wow, we smiling, Tommy B. <laughs> Woo, baby, I'm having a great time. My mom inspires me. She lost a child. She lost her husband of damn near 35 years in an accident. She's an epileptic, and I don't know if I know a kinder lady besides her that's alive now. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, my mom, one of the finest ladies ever, and I'll drink to that. Dad, if you're watching, I hope this is the only video of mine you watch. <laughs> you wouldn't be impressed with the other ones. Old Rocky called a spade a spade. You always knew where you stood with him. Anyway, Michael, great idea. This might have been the worst response anybody ever gave, but that's what you get when you get with Tommy B. Hope everybody doing well. Be good. Be honest and Boston. You leave them little girls alone, my friend. Salute to you, sir. Salute to your dad. And adios. Tommy Galvez out.